And uh, what for you has been a very meaningful thing? I know you go out sometimes on a Thursday night and you hand out sandwiches to the people. Um, how have you found that? Has is, is that been quite a good thing for you? What is one experience you remember well? Um, one of the experiences I remember well is um, when, I, when we first met one of our friends, Chilani, who he was sleeping on the street and he has been addicted to glue for quite a long time and he had been hit by a car and his leg was very broken. Sure. And so he was sleeping in the corner without a blanket. And at first, we drove past him and we just thought, because he was sleeping under cardboard, we just thought it was a pile of rubbish. But then I noticed it move and I said, Dad, there's someone there. We have to go help them. They have no blankets at all. So I went up to him and we pretty much loved him. And it was truly amazing because um, it was the coldest night when it snowed and... We handed out blankets and to everyone. And I just felt then that actually these people are equal to us. They're not different from us at all. They need help and we need to help them. And if it was us in that situation, we, we'd want people to help us as well. So I'm having to compose myself here. <laughs> but um, when, when you say, Dad, we need, we need to go over and help him. And we need to show him some love. Um, help us. I mean, what, what would be the very first thing apart from going over? What does that showing love entail? What does it mean? It means you're treating someone very equal to you. It means you're loving someone. It means you're showing the person that they are not just someone um, less, less. Yeah. So th th this might sound like a crazy question and you might be offended by it, but do you touch them? Do you embrace them? You know, these are dirty people. They've probably been lying there, not bathed or clean at all. Well, if you think, Jesus told us that, um, well, um, Jesus could be that person. And if he was Jesus, what would you do? Would you push them away because he has dirty? I wouldn't because... He, even if I was dirty like that, it doesn't really mean dirty. You, we are also dirty spiritually. We are sometimes selfish. We are sometimes, um, yeah. Wow. Making your dad proud there. To you, tell you, isn't that wonderful? Let's give her an applause. I mean, that is a very, very mature response.